Hey everyone, I'm Mackenzie, and in this video, we are going to learn how to do auto motion tracking in Premiere Pro. Let's get started. So there are several ways to auto track someone's face, but this is the easiest way I have found. Let's jump into our timeline and get started. What I have here is a clip of two individuals, and I want to blur the one on the right. I want to blur his face. So there's a couple ways I can do this, but the way I always do it is I highlight the clip, and then I go into my effects panel, and I type in blur. What that brings up is in the video effects folder, the blur and sharpen folder, Gaussian blur, and I'm just going to drag that onto my clip. I'm going to highlight this clip, I'm going to go into my effects controls panel, and I'm going to go down to Gaussian Blur, and I'm going to hit this circle button. That creates an ellipse mask. And now I can move this ellipse mask anywhere around on this clip, but I'm going to move it to his face, so it highlights his entire face like so. And then what I'm going to do is I am going to increase the blurness. Now, as you can see, it does the job of blurring his face. I'm going to go over here and increase the feather. But as the clip moves around, or as he moves around within the clip, the circle stays in the exact same spot. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to my first frame here in the clip, and I'm going to adjust this circle so that it matches up perfectly with his face. And then all I'm going to do is go into my mask path and I'm going to hit this play button right here. And now what it's doing is it's auto tracking his face so that uh, it matches up with those four points on the circle. It tries to stay in those exact same places in the clip. And so once it finishes its tracking, let's see how it did. Now, as you can see, it tracked his face and followed his face throughout the entire clip. And that is how you use auto motion tracking in Premiere Pro. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to comment down below. Hit that subscribe button while you're at it, and we'll see you real soon.